ハローめぐっぺです私は今自分の英語を使ってできることの可能性をいろいろと探っているところなんですがその一環としてスピーチの練習をしています今日はその模様を紹介します Hi, this is Meg.、Um, when I was surfing on the web the other day, I noticed that I haven't read the newspapers for a long time. So today I want to ask you this question Did you read the newspapers this morning? Me? No. So,、uh, from all the experiences I had for the past few years, I think that we can say that newspapers are no longer the best source of news. There are two reasons. First of all,、um, the development of technology gives us a lot more options other than newspapers to get the news. As you know, the internet is the biggest development. So we can take the news、um, in real time wherever you are. We can read the news at home, at the office, in a car, on a train, on a bus, anywhere. And,、um, The news on the internet is at, updated at every second. Although there is a time lag between,、uh, in, uh, there is a time lag in newspapers between the time、uh, the incidents occur and the time we receive the report. And in, a, in addition, we have to subscribe the newspapers if we want to read them. Or we have to go to the stores, like convenience stores, to get ones. Also, We can get the news from our friends through、uh, SNS or videos. People post and share the news that they are interested in with their friends. So once we are on、uh, SNS like Facebook, we can get the news shared. And it's easier and quicker、uh, to spread the news around the world. And it's quite common these days. And second of all, Uh, the actual subscription rate is getting lower. As I take the survey,、um, newspapers are still popular among old people because、um, they feel familiar with them because they were the source for them for a long time. But、um, a lot of people,、uh, especially people who are in their 20s to their 40s, including me, Don't read newspapers. You know, it's said that modern people are busy. So, busy people don't have a time to read newspapers thoroughly. So,、um, a good thing about the internet is that the, uh, the uh, titles are shortened and listed in one place. So, we can choose what we want to read. But on the other hand,、um, we have to go through all the articles. If we try to read the newspapers, right? And,、um, uh, and then I hear sometimes, I sometimes hear that people don't want to subscribe the newspapers anymore because they don't want to see the pile of newspapers, especially when they can、uh, finish reading. And, and it can, you know,、uh, be a stress. And the other aspect of the low subscription rate is that、um, we learned that we cannot trust the newspapers anymore. Because、um, it is true that newspapers cannot always、uh, be trustworthy, but there was a bad example here in Japan.、Um, one of the biggest newspaper companies in Japan released a wrong report about one incident. And、that had been believed that it was true and gave a wrong、uh, image of Japan around the world. When the time the newspaper was a big and important、um, source of news. And Japan has been accused of the bogus story for a long time after that. But later we found out that. We found out the fact that what they、uh, reported, like it existed, did not exist. And, um, and, um, what,、uh, and they did not admit that they were wrong back then, but years later, I think it was only、um, a couple years 
later, uh, a couple of years ago, uh, one or two years ago, they uh, uh, apologized for what they did, but it was too late. So um, the this fall event uh, lost our trust in newspapers. It's not the only one incident, but it was one of them and one of the biggest incidents occurred. So um, I think that um, it is us who decide on what to use or what to read. And from my standpoint, uh, newspapers are no longer the best source of news. What do you think? Thank you. というわけで今日は私が今練習しているスピーチの模様をお届けしましたいかがでしたか自分の英語で何をやってみたいかと考えてみるのもいい刺激になるかもしれませんぜひ考えてみてくださいメグッペでしたまたね